2015 Flight Day 8 Mission Status Briefing. We'll provide an update of today's spacewalk activities and the mission management team meeting. With us to... Uh, at about 1400 Central Time today, we asked Rick for another glove check. And uh, at that time, he reported that he had the primary layer of his glove in the left thumb. He had some damage to that. And uh, that damage was... Uh, was enough that it was time to call the EVA and, and terminate the EVA. Down a little more. Yeah. Down right. more to the left. You said it's on your thumb? Yeah. On the tip? No, kind of about halfway. See the okay. uh, exposed effect tram? Go more left and up. Okay, perfect. That's actually a little bigger. Today, the, the mission management team um, decided that the next EVA will be no earlier than Saturday. Um, they haven't decided if uh, that would be a TPS repair EVA or the fourth uh, planned EVA that we have for its mission, but we did decide it's going to be no earlier than Saturday. In a portable foot restraint at the end of the Canadarm2, pilot Charlie Hobaugh at the robotics workstation in the Destiny Laboratory about to move him from the port truss uh, of the station over to the starboard side of the truss system as he manually uh, moves this uh, CETA cart uh, from one location to another. I don't think so. Okay. All right, Trace. Okay, guys. Um, do not impart loads in the CETA cart with less than four or four wheel bogeys latched closed.